our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English. Finance, Angie speaking. Hi Angie, it's Tom Reynolds here. Can you tell me if my tuition fees for this semester have been approved? Yes, Mr. Reynolds. They were approved yesterday. You can pick up the check today. Oh wow, thanks a million, Angie. What did you usually do as a head nurse? I allocate different patients with their consent to different nurses. And I supervise the primary nurses and help nurses carry out their work. How to maintain a high standard of nursing? To maintain a high standard of nursing, we should take experience and education into consideration while considering a nurse's level of expertise in caring for various patients. Here is the draft contract, Mr. Brown. Let's discuss the clauses to see if we agree on all of them. Then I will make out an original of the contract. After that, what's left is to fill out the contract and sign our names. That's okay. The contract is to be written in Chinese and English. Both languages are equally effective. Fine. If you'll excuse me, I'd like to go it over first. After about 15 minutes, hum, you've done a pretty good job. It's well prepared. Thank you. Well, I suggest that we discuss only the clauses and points where we have different opinions just to save time. That's a good idea. First, let's read clause 2 about packing. It's our usual practice to ship our products in containers. That'll save time and money but your contract stipulates the use of wooden cases. So, we'd like to have the words containers are allowed in the contract. Agreed. For shipment, you know we are producing a complete set of equipment for you and it won't all be finished at one time. So would you allow us to make partial shipments? I understand your position. Excuse me, but are you Mrs. Smith from America? That's it. I am Maria Smith. You must be Zhang Lin from Tianjin Sports Facility Co. Limited. Yes. Nice to meet you, Mrs. Smith. Nice to meet you too, Mr. Zhang. Hello, this is Stephen. May I speak to Mr. Xu? Yes, speaking. I need to make an appointment with you today. Okay, what time is it? 3 o'clock this afternoon. I'm afraid I'll be tied up at 3 o'clock this afternoon. Could you make it 5 o'clock this afternoon? Yes, that would be better. Fine, goodbye. Goodbye. Hi, Isaiah. How are you? I'm well. And you? Fine. How's your job going? I don't know if I told you or not, but I decided to start my own business. Really? That's fantastic. What kind of business is it? I've started an investment banking firm with some of my old colleagues from Goldman Sachs. How's it going? It started off a bit slow, but now, business is really booming. That's such great news. I'm really happy for you. Where is your office located? Our head office is here in Beijing, but we're planning on opening up two more offices soon. Where will those be located? If all goes well, we'll open one up in Hong Kong in April and another one in Singapore in October. When will you find out? 
We're negotiating the final details of the leasing contracts tomorrow. Well, good luck. I hope it all goes well for you tomorrow. Thanks. Now, Mr. William, a little personal information first, are you married? Yes, I am. Actually my wife is a teacher. What's your major? German. How long have you been studying in German? Since I first met my wife, about three years. And just one more question, would you like to be an interpreter? Yes, I'd like to do that. Very good, you can come here to work next month. Thank you. Hello, is that Xiaoging Li who applied for the solar studio of our college? Yes, speaking. I want to know whether you will come to the interview. So have you accepted offers from other companies? No, I haven't got one by now. I will go to the interview of yours. This is today's schedule. At 8.30 a.m., conference with the department managers. At 9 o'clock, live for the workshop where you'll award prizes to the staff for preventatives. That's great. What are the prizes? 3,000 rib as bonus for each person. To encourage the staff increases. Okay. Next thing is laying the corner stone for the new plant at 10 a.m. At 12 a.m., back here for lunch. What about the afternoon? At 2 p.m., give a presentation here with the press. At 4 o'clock sharp, have dinner with Mr. Smith, manager of NCC. Where did you study accounting? I studied at Anshan University. Did you intern anywhere? Yes, I interned with an accounting firm during tax season. That must have been stressful. Yes, but I learned a lot. I'll bet. I learned about different tax laws and how they work. Are you Lu Yan? That's right. Have you brought your credentials? Yes, here you are. Let me have a look. Okay. Your resume says you worked at DK Company for two years. What were you responsible for? I was responsible for sales. Have you received any honorable title personally? Yes. I was twice singled out as an advanced worker. Well, considering your qualifications, we believe you would be a suitable candidate. Following our free educational materials, you learn English in a great way with ease and efficiency.